Hello everyone, we're facing the Riders of the Storm here. They represent wind, lightning, and thunder. Uh, the guy to the left has a battering ram, the other guy has a sword, and the other guy has a, a spear. So you get a checkpoint after every single enemy, and it just kind of depends. The, the guy with the battering ram is rather slow, although his, his attacks have a very large radius, so if you want to go for the guy with the spear or the sword, that would be my best bet, although I am kind of picking on this guy here. Um, just remember that if you get parries, the synchronized blocks, that if you're going to go for follow-up counterattacks, just watch out for other enemies because they don't pacify off-screen, they will continue to attack you. So there was a missed opportunity to do a counterattack, that was my bad. Um, it's just kind of recognizing what they all do. There's the first checkpoint, and it looks like I slayed the guy with, uh, with the sword, now it's just the spear guy plus the battering ram enemy. And the uh, the former is using his uh, lightning attack because he's the ruler of lightning. And uh, just watch out for that, that attack. It's an area of effect attack. It just has a different uh, like black, oily colored like texture to it. Other than that, um, when they have their elemental attacks on, you cannot use your... Um, first of all, you can't block or anything like that. you got to evade. And you can't use the mist. It's going to counteract the mist, so that's one consideration here. But they're unblockable attacks, you can use the mist on those, but you see how that attack that he did, it was an elemental attack, it, it threw me right out of the mist. And it had me in what I presume is a quick time event, if I had those particular ones on. So for this guy I'm going to hit him right through his, his uh, revolving spear, and this is the last guy right here. And there will be a final section after him where he's supposed to approach him, um, and he's uh, casting the wind at you, wind at you, and you can barely move, but you can still use the shoulder charge. So, uh, this guy is very sluggish. You can see when he has the lightning on his weapon, just evade, get out of the way, and you know, just heal yourself as necessary. And there we go. Uh, yeah, he also does that lightning splash attack. He'll do a circular one that you need to jump jump up and avoid it uh, per usual and then he'll also have a, a a vertical one that just comes right at you but here's the final leg of our journey with this boss there is no checkpoint so be very careful here when he slams his cudgel down you just need to evade left or right or you know up and diagonal and as you close in on him you'll get a cutscene and then that's the end of it we'll be on the mirror of fate chapter next